Now Rayquaza. Step it up, grand final, sitting on winner's side, sitting pretty. Nom Hundred dollars. Yeah, nowhere near to be contested right now unless Nam can take this. Technically, even if he only wins one set, he gets fifty dollars because he technically if still he can losers. Yep. Yeah, oh okay, so it's like the As far as it's like the Jabaili one. Yeah, as far as I understood it, he will still get half the bounty. Okay. You know, is that like a is that like a standing thing where it's always relevant? Or is it like a one time thing? I thought it was actually a one-time thing, but uh, he left the money here, and he announced the bounty was still up for grabs. So I'm like, so like, what happens okay. if I like? I mean, like, what it, what it, what happens if somebody wins, and then next week you're like, all right, well, is there another hundred dollar bounty on Ray, or is it just like? I'm assuming. No, I, so it's just like, well, I don't I think the first person to do it gets. I, yeah, I don't know. Like, like what happens if somebody knocks him into losers but loses the tournament? Nobody beat him, so like, is there is there a new hundred dollar bounty? What's the deal Render here? Three, just because it's nine thirty already. All right, though. Grand finals about to get underway. Nam It'll be best of three because it is nine thirty. So yeah, definitely looked at that clock. You know, it's surprising. Like, there's a lot. There were a lot of setups for fourteen entrants tonight. Two yeah, of, two of my own, that. and then I believe uh, four other people, including yourself, already brought yeah. one. So it's kind of nice. Yeah, the Gucci setups coming in big to make the tournament run a bit smoother. Oh yeah. You always need them. Yep. All right, and now I'm going to the Bayonetta Blue. Uh, probably the best or second best color, in my opinion. I like the pink fresh colors. The, the genre color is so overused. That's why it, it just has no – it's cool, but it's like, man, it's so lame now. Oh, anyway, uh, yeah, I guess. I'm, I'm a, just a big fan of Bayonetta 1 mm. or Bayonetta – like Bayonetta 1, blue and regular – or default, and then Bayonetta 2 default. Anyway, <laughs> starting off. Rayquaza only thirty percent def or only thirty percent on him, while uh, now it's about a forty percent deficit. But now I'm trying to find Claw's way back into this match to uh, close this gap. But Rayquaza setting up chop, fortress installed. <laughs> Absolutely, and Rayquaza just eat tearing Nam apart in his attempted combo game. Yeah. And that's really where he's kind of falling apart, taking a lot of up airs and taking a lot of down airs that just over time build up so much percent. And he's having a really hard time getting rid of Luma as well. Luma has been on the stage for most of the time. I don't know if he's knocked him away yet, once yet. Yeah. All right, let's see, though. Struggling to get in is Nam. Not finding any kind of openings. Yep. And, and there see, there's that thing. Nam loves to side B while he's at the ledge. And Rayquaza has already adapted. He adapted that during the um, winner's final set. And just, like, even now, he's starting to get it. Like, he recognized every time Nam does that, he's like, all right, cool, I'm just going to turn around to up smash. I'll get the sweet spot every time. Yeah, and Nam, so Nam's got to find a mix-up off the ledge. He's just choosing so many aggressive options, and, and Rayquaza just tearing him apart for it. Yep. You see him land there with an air very unsafely. Now he's trying to fish for a back air and trying to get, okay, trying to get started something off the pair. Yep, all right. Nam on his last stock, though, 80%. Rayquaza. His positioning is so uncanny. Like, he just puts himself perfectly to, to challenge Dom whenever he tries to start up something. Is that going to seal the deal? It, it will. will. Right, 89%. Pretty clutch. Rayquaza, I think he was SDIing up, so he might have gotten caught with some uh, sus DI. Mm -hmm. Just because he's SDIing up, you end up just getting caught with the uh, up air by assisting it. Yeah, I think most uh, <laughs> I think most of them, I may be mistaken, but I think that you're supposed to SDI up because of, of her floatiness. I see. Uh, Toe Def and I were talking about this, like where, how do float? Like we know that fastballers want to SDI down in a way because yeah. the more they're SDIing down, just the, their fastball instinct hits in. But I gotta re -evalu I gotta go check up on that floaties. So that's gotta help me. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, you gotta know these things, man. But uh, from what I've heard from Tone Def, I think it's SDI up. But I could be. I mean, it, it changes from situation to situation. Yeah. And I, it can lead to mix up. So you gotta. You just gotta know. Um, exactly. It's very hard to know. All right, 134%. Nam chooses to do a standard get-up option. Yeah, and that jab going to kill eventually, but no uh, Rage on Rayquaza just yet. Yep. One thing that is so hard when you're fighting Rayquaza is that when he sets up himself, like, with jabs, where he's got Luma at the... Oh, oh my God, is this going to be it? Oh, <laughs> got to hold your breath for a minute. Ooh, I think what Nam... Like, Nam went for the jump, either jump up air or just up air. Oh, oh no, yeah. Now I'm, uh, now I'm always does jump up B, and I'm just, don't do that. It's up B, jump up B. <laughs> <laughs> like, it doesn't matter if you say go it, low. Say it one more time. Up, or jump, or up B, jump. Up, up B. B, yeah. And then and then you've got all your resources right there. Exactly. Yeah. Now heard me. <laughs> <laughs> the thumbs he, up approval. He's been, he's been doing 
just jump up B. You're not chic, bro. Not chic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. That's uh, polar opposites, but you that, that's already. one of those things where you like when you're Bayo is so young. You're just like you got to remember that it's the the role the reversal of what you were ingrained to do. It takes time. But yep. running back into Grand Finals, game number two, can he even this up? Just like he did last time. He did get off to a slow start last time in Winner's Finals, but yeah. he's able to bring it back in an exciting game two, so we'll see if he can repeat some of that magic. One thing I need, Nam needs to start doing more is, like, if he wants to get these, er, like, combos, he, oh, he's got to air dodge. Yeah. yeah. If he, he had to air dodge to start swinging his momentum back into the stage, or he actually <laughs> would have died there. Oh, uh, I was saying, like, he needs to start utilizing down tilt more. Use it as a uh, kind of like a spacing tool, kind of like call out Rayquaza on uh, his drop shield drops. You're seeing it right now, and he's using it to carry away Luma, but I think he's just trying to scoop Ray up. And uh, not, not, not close enough, and it's really hard to get in on him, though, especially with that. Yep. And you see Nam always air dodging. Bayonetta just love to use that air dodge because of bats within. But against a player who's as proficient as ju at juggling as Rayquaza, you always want to try and contest with an aerial, like an air or down air, or you just want to go and retreat right to the ledge. Definitely want to try to mix it up, right? And just uh, use all, utilize all your options against a character like Ray, who is going to pick you apart for that if you continue to use the same options. Yep, and look at that, Ray setting himself at a perfect distance to cover every single option in the best way possible. Mm -hmm. Just using those star bits to the best, and oh, nah, yeah, too much, too much. Use the jump, but that forward throw should no, it set won't. himself up. But it will put him in good position. The Nair, oh wow, what a good answer using the Witch Twist out of the Nair to still catch Rayquaza. All right, never fair one Luma, because it instantly resets Luma into a spot oh my. where Luma can attack. Uh, but like always <laughs> just use down air or up just throw throw out one of your heavy moves or forward throw that also is an, a, a great luma killer full climax maybe no okay boot go off in air okay nice down tilt pokes at luma's head or rose's head nice up air that's gonna seal the deal five percent down this is definitely doable for nam he just gotta play calm find his openings utilize that down tilt as a space tool try and get rayquaza to overcommit a little bit because right right now rayquaza is just sitting real pretty mm. having nam be on the approach all the time he power shielded his dash tech and immediately spot dodged when he could have easily uh gotten a good punish right there yeah and also if you ever see rosalina's shoot out luma luma's away go in yep just jump right that, over oppress that space goddess that's right You're, he's opening himself up giving you a window but right now, he's got Nam off stage and just keeping him at a disadvantage, putting him in the corner, and you just cannot get past this great wall of Ray. Great wall of Rayquaza. Oh, and there's that Luma again. Nam not being very aware of where the Luma is. Yep. And there is Luma getting the up air. He's, Rayquaza is so proficient at using Luma to get those extra strong hitboxes. Ooh, now how are you going to get back to the stage? All right. Good Wisely just avoid all contact with Rayquaza because Ray, if... Nam had touched Na uh, Ray on shield at all. Not Ray would have just up smash out of shield instantly to get the kill. Yeah, very good stuff from Nam. But you know you have to still keep in mind that he does have Witch Time, which does not have been used yet. Yeah, Witch is Time is fresh. definitely still. Oh, the up smash, and now he's in Witch Time area where he could get the kill. Yeah, this is very dangerous for now, Rayquaza. That Rayquaza narrated, and that, that's one thing Ray oh. really loves to do. Uh, if uh, Rosalina just uh, uses Nair as an approach option on Bayonetta. Just witch time it. Just witch time it. Absolutely. Oh, that, that yeah. Witch time. <laughs> but he used witch time previously, and now it, it's a little it, bit stale. It takes 15 seconds. Oh, my God. Again. Oh. Anyway, uh, now it's dropped. 15 seconds. Uh, it's a 15-second recharge for uh, witch time. So once you've used it 